We're looking forward to the weeks and the months ahead of earning the support of Winnipeggers from every area of the city. The only poll that matters is on election day, said mayoral candidate Brian Bowman. The privacy lawyer officially entered the mayoral race on Tuesday with his wife and two young sons in tow and registered at City Hall. The most recent Incitrix poll scored Bowman at less than 10% in comparison to competitors such as Judy Washalisa Lees and Gord Steves, who scored 42% and 17% respectively. And ultimately, the only poll that matters is on election day. Um, I know that I'm, as, as someone new to the political process, uh, I know that I've got, to have, I've got to work really hard to, to build and earn the support of Winnipeggers, and starting today, that's exactly what I'm doing. The rookie politician addressed concern raised that by entering Entering the race, he stacks the right wing choices, possibly creating a vacuum a left leaning candidate like Judy could fill. What I recognize and what I like about municipal politics is that you can work with people across the political spectrum. Uh, it's, I've made no secret of the fact that my political roots are uh, fiscally conservative. I respect taxpayers and I re respect tax dollars. He is still working on his platform, but offered a few clues on what he will be running on. I think Winnipeggers are looking for value for money. They're looking for a return on their investment, and I think that's a fair proposition. I pay my taxes, and I'm, I'm, I have to say, if I was satisfied with the level of service that we're getting for the taxpayers we send to City Hall, uh, I wouldn't be running. I'm not satisfied. I think we can do better. The selection of the right CAO is important. Rapid transit needs to happen, and he supports phase two of the BRT and believes in a well-costed plan if tax increases occur. At the end of the day, if we're going to build a stronger Winnipeg, we have to have a comprehensive plan to, to obviously fix the infrastructure problems, create a safer community, and create better jobs for us and our kids. And that's not right or left. That's just something that I think should be an expectation of any mayor.